What's up, everybody? Jay's here from jazbeescasebreaks.com doing another personal box. 2019 Panini Stars and Stripes Baseball personal box. It's a one boxer with one Father's Day pack included. So, Eric, EO, with a box purchase here on our YouTube channel. So, just like we've been doing it all day, we have these packs numbered. We're going to generate a number, and that's the pack you're going to get if it is available. If not, we'll keep on generating until there is a pack number available. And generate 24. Ooh, 24. Kobe. Kobe. All right, here's 24. It's, it is 24, of course. It's just that, like, fingerprint on it. But there is a 2-4 right there. So there you go. And then here's your personal box. This actually has been very fun to rip, though, guys. Very cool stuff. <clears throat> nice patches. Nice, like, international autographs as well. Pretty cool, actually. So good luck. I wonder if the Lakers got the number one in the lottery if they would have traded away. I don't, oh man, imagine they would have done that. They would have traded Zion. But I feel like they would have though because I feel like they want somebody to win now. But again, Zion, I think he's ready, you know? I think he's like, I think he's ready. <laughs> like he's a man, <laughs> you know? He doesn't need a couple years in the NBA to get better. It's like he's gonna get better playing in the NBA. He's year one. So that was uh, Daniel Cabrera to one ninety nine. I don't know if I trade the number one for Davis, but knowing the Lakers management, they really want Anthony Davis. I think they probably would have, because they're banking on like, well, we already have a talented player that's already proven to that can play in the NBA. The twenty five, Yohandi Morales. <sighs> Yeah, but see, that's only, yeah, exactly. Like, Anthony Davis is great when he's healthy. Who's to say that he doesn't get injured and, you know, miss like 20 games? Those 20 games are going to be killer. CJ Abrams, 499. But, yeah, I, I think they, I think the Lakers are just trying to win now. Yeah, exactly. They might have been able to keep more people. For sure. I'm just happy. Like, I, I'm not even a Laker fan, but I'm just, like, happy they didn't trade Kuzma. If Kuzma was part of that trade, I would have been like, dude, dude. Seriously, like, dude. <laughs> Brennan Malone. 289. <clears throat> but now you look at, like, LeBron, AD, Kuzma. You're just like, dude. That's a good big three. And then you're going to add, hopefully, a good point guard. Right, like Kemba, if he does come. It'd be crazy if Kyrie came. Like, if Kyrie Irving actually were to come to the Lakers, would you just write him off as, like, at least going to the finals? Like, I, I would still say no, only because you never know what's going to happen in the, in the NBA. <clears throat> to 99, Zach Hess. But it's like so many... I swear, Nick, yesterday, like, I was, you know, I was spending time with my family, and everybody was just like, AD, baby, AD. You know, it's like AD. Did you hear about AD? I'm like, yes, I heard it. <laughs> I'm hearing it everywhere. It's like a, the radio from the everything, the news. It's like, yes, guys, I do know what's going on with AD. I I I like Kemba too. But okay, either one of those. Do you write them off as these like going to the finals? It's like it's a it's for sure. All right, pack twenty four. Yo, good luck. Charles Barkley, Philadelphia edition. And Riley Ridley. Nice. And that is to 199. Is that like Calvin Ridley's younger brother? All right, there you go, Eric. Appreciate it, man. Some nice stuff coming out of here. Coming up next, Box for Jack Legacy. Appreciate it.